In this video I want to show how to create a footprint chart that actually will monitor the number of trades at the bid or the ask versus the actual volume at the bid or the ask. So in this case we'll be trying to find out really how many actual trades are occurring not really referring to the volume. And so in order to do so I've, I've opened up a footprint chart. This is just a basic uh, bid ask footprint chart with a footprint price statistic indicator applied over here and it's just uh, you can see what it is footprint price statistic with the volume profile only so nothing special there I've done no customization to this chart at this time so the first thing I want to do if you note these are all volumes it's showing how much volume traded the ask versus the bid at any particular price and the color is just simply showing or reflective of how much volume traded at the ask versus the bid. If it's any shade of blue would represent more aggressive buying, more trading at the ask. So I'm going to double click the chart and choose the footprint data tab. Notice it says chart volume at price. If you click that drop down there's other options and we're gonna in this case choose trades. Chart trades at price. So I'm going to click OK and you'll note when I do these quantities everything's different now. We're actually looking at the number of trades not volume. I know I'm saying that a lot but it, I want to make sure everyone understands why these numbers changed. OK so now we can there's all sorts of things we can do with this now uh, but let's add a volume filter so another thing you can do if you wanted to just get an idea of the institutional trades size that was above a certain level and look and really monitor just how many trades occurred at that you could check this box and choose greater than and you may want to choose let's just choose 49 in this example so anything a 50 lot or greater would be reflected on the chart and you'll, you'll notice these should change into smaller values now so now we're really seeing just just trades that were 50 lots or higher. So maybe to make this uh, a little more applicable, I'm going to press the insert key to add a technical indicator. Choose the volume breakdown indicator. And notice it says ask versus bid traded volume. We want trades. We want to look at the actual trades. And the result notice it says delta buy minus sell volume let's just we could go total trades or ticks but let's just go with this one you'll see what it's gonna do and it's gonna add as a histogram and click OK so this is showing us the net number of trades at the ask versus the net number of trades at the bid you can see that what the number is so if we wanted to apply that same filter that we just applied up top to only take into account 50 lots or greater or whatever you may want I could check this box consider only trades that were actually we'll do 49 and click OK and so here's your numbers now everything's filtered down both up in the footprint and in the volume breakdown indicator to show us trades that were 50 lots or greater. And you may find it better to actually look at this in a connected line. Some people may like it that way. And, and there you go. Hopefully you found this video useful. For more information, please refer to the volume breakdown indicator in the knowledge base or watch some of the other videos that show how to use the bid ask footprint. Thanks and make a great day. Thank you.